Go, 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 go. Hey. channel I am John here with Jeremy doing a very special unboxing you know why because that's what we do it is something big this is the ultimate Tony Rice guitar clone shootout of the things that uh, when I finally saw the picture that I was most impressed with this sunburst this looks original it looks right guys enjoy it. This is Alan Bybee in Grasstown. Uh, my name is Alec Beshin. I took that idea, kind of built on it layer by layer. It kind of sounded like and reminded me of some of my influences, so I called the song Borrowed. Hey guys, it is New Guitar Thursday. Glad to be with you on Thursday. It has been a weird day today. Welcome back. It's Takeover Tuesday. I'm so happy to have you back here at the acoustic shop. Mask on! You thought I was going for the home improvement, the old Tim Allen sting, but I gotcha. I played sweet child of mine very badly. So, guys, welcome back. It's my Takeover Tuesday. I'm here. I'm enjoying all of the new stuff that we got in. We have a lot of new stuff, but I'll be honest with you, I can't show you any of it right now. I just can't. Uh, one reason is because they're filming next door with a lot of it. Uh, just It's just being used right now. I'd love to show it to you. I'd love to play it for you. But I can't. It's because John and Corey are filming with it right now. So there's some great content to come, just so you know. Now, I do want to start out by saying that the blue chip giveaway 
is still active. It is active until the 30th. Next week. Next one week. week. Next week. One more week, guys. One more week. So that is an Instagram only giveaway. So the post is live. You're going to want to go to our Instagram page. You're going to want to make sure that you're following us. You'll want to comment and tag a friend. And that's really the only uh, stipulations for the giveaway. And was there was there anything else that I should add? Okay, no. The link is in the description. Oh, the oh the link is it the link is in the description of this video, so you can go straight to it right from this video. I'll take you right over to it. Uh, so yeah, make sure you're entered uh, to get it because these are expensive. I'm not gonna lie to you. I've already lost one of them. I'm not gonna replace it. It's expensive, guys, and I'm giving one away. I'm just gonna ship it right out to you, free, free of charge, guys. Forty dollars. Ain't nothing for me, all right? I got all the money and all the picks. That's not true at all, guys. I, 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 literally, I literally just said uh, that I lost one and I'm not gonna replace it. No, 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 uh, for real, blue chip picks, I will be honest with you. Um, so blue chip comes from uh, my home area of East Tennessee in Knoxville. So uh, very close to home for me. Um, I have been a pick snob for 15 years. I've, pl I've played guitar for about t over 20 years now. I've played guitar for about 22 years now. Okay. And I have wondered what the perfect pick is for the last 15 years. The first six, seven years, I don't know, dude. I just, I just play, I just played with whatever I had around or whatever anyone had. And I just didn't care. Uh, but after a while, you kind of get into it. You kind of start looking at different picks, different pick shapes, different thicknesses, different gauges, different materials. There's so much that goes into picking the perfect pick. And we've done some pick videos before. Actually, we've done several. We've done pick shootouts with the Chapmans. I've done two Takeover Tuesdays on picks, maybe even three. I can't even remember. I think when the Wiegans came in, I think we did a third one. So I've done, I've talked a lot about picks and I'm not an expert, but I've tried a lot of picks, and I think I know what I like nowadays. And honestly, I have to say that this blue chip jazz pick here that I have, that is in a 60, uh, this I think I think this is as close to the one as I've ever been. Uh, I think this this was my original one here. Let me grab it. It's in here somewhere. Hold up, hold up. I gotta I gotta I gotta pan out the time. You know, yeah, yeah. we make we make these guys wait for like five minutes. I gotta at least talk for a minute, right? Yeah. So I gotta find some stuff to talk about. These are these are my normal picks, okay? The cool picks. These are just Delrin. This is literally just Delrin with a little grip on it. I just love them. I love these picks. These are I still use these quite a bit, especially on electrics. I love the way that Delrin, like a matted plastic, sounds on electric guitars. I just prefer it. But for acoustics, blue chip all the way. I am I am willing to spend the extra money to get these picks because they feel really good. And that's a weird thing to say, but they feel really good. In your hands, gliding across the strings, it is, it is definitely a very uh, specific feel that's kind of hard to describe really. Um, but it grips to you very nicely, glides across the strings very nicely. Um, you know, we've done, we've done some uh, pick comparisons here recently because uh, we're gonna be bringing on some new picks very soon. Um, and they're very much like tortoise shell. Um, so, I mean, we've done quite a bit of pick comparisons here lately and blue chip is still just like, it's way up there, way up there. I mean, it's, it's still, even if you don't, even if you can't see anything, you probably still will tell the difference. At least the Chapman's did, you know, but they're, they're pretty tuned into that stuff. They, uh, they, they really kind of know what they're hearing. You know, they've, they've tuned their ears very well. But, uh, but yeah, guys, we're giving a free one away. That's the main thing. I'm just rambling at this point. Um, that's the main thing I want to tell you is that we're giving one of these away. Any gauge, any size that you want, if we don't have it in stock, let us know. You have up to 45 bucks, I believe, to play with. So uh, yeah, we'll just, we'll order it for you. You might have to wait a little bit longer, but that's fine. It's worth the wait, it's free. You know, even if you get it like 10 years from now, it'll be free, okay? Like if I forget to ship it out, yeah, that's my fault. But look, man, it's free, all right? You can't complain too much, right? No, yes, you can. That's, that's really bad customer service, guys. Yes, if something takes way too long to get out, yes, you should complain. That you is, we will, we will get it to you in a timely fashion. That's a good way to say that. Um, so guys, I wanna talk about what's coming up 
Um, it's not too early to start talking about some of the events that we have coming up and holidays. As weird as that is, it's not too soon. I mean, we're not we're not even in September yet, but guys, people are gearing up already, okay? We have Winfield in about 20 or so days. We're gonna have a pretty big booth at Winfield and we've got a pretty good crew going over there. I'm pretty sure it's just the Chapmans and the whole media team, so it's gonna be a pretty stacked crew over there. Um, we've got lots of stuff we're taking with us to that. Should be a pretty big event. Winfield is always crazy. I mean, some of you out there that have been, it's wild. It's a great time too. So looking forward to that. We have IBMA later in the year. And then right after IBMA, we have Small Business Saturday. So, I mean, it's the time is just flying by, guys. And I can't stress enough. Uh, I mean, right after Small Business Saturday, you got Christmas coming up. But we don't really do, I'm going to be honest with you, we don't do anything crazy for Christmas. We do something crazy for Small Business Saturday. And that is the Saturday right after Black Friday. So we kind of do uh, literally an all-day event. If you haven't seen it, if you haven't been a part of it, um, it's all day. It's literally all day. We we get here at around, I don't know, 8 o'clock in the morning. We don't stop until like 10, 11, 12, till everything's gone. We stay until everything has been sold. That includes picks, that includes stands, that includes our souls. I mean, whatever it takes, guys. You know, um, we're, we are trying to give you the best we got. But we're going to have some sweet deals coming up for Small Business Saturday and... We're gonna have some awesome stuff at the events coming up. So, I also want to talk about, now it's all, oh, 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 okay. I got the finger, I got the finger. I caught wind that there's going to be a huge giveaway uh, during Winfield and IBM. Is that actually, right? Do you know what it is? No, I, I, don't think, I, don't think, I don't think I know what it is. I don't think I'm supposed to say, but it's, really? it's big. Wow. Can you, can and it you, sounds really can I, good. can I mute my microphone and yeah. you tell me? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna, hold on one second, guys. Yeah. That's, whoa, guys. Yeah. I know I just muted myself and you didn't hear anything, I'm hoping, but uh, that's a pretty big deal. Uh, so th now I have just heard, I have uh, just now caught wind that they are doing a huge giveaway at, at both. It'll or just or just Winfield. Oh, oh, it'll be throughout all yeah, of the not, events it's not coming up. Connected, but okay. It'll be throughout the duration of those two. Interesting. Interesting. So, don't have too many details yet to be honest with you, but all just I can say us. is follow us, make sure that you're subscribed, make sure that you're that you've liked the page on Facebook because that's how you're going to see a lot of the things that we're talking about and uh, announcing. But uh, yeah, pr apparently we're doing a big giveaway uh, then. I didn't even know about it until just now. I you know, they, they keep me in the dark in, until I'm on camera and then they tell me everything and they go, okay, all right, tell them about it. Also, uh, <laughs> yeah, tell me. Ah, so we can't we can yes. say that now. Okay, yeah. so guys, the guitar hunter, Mr. Shepherd, will be here next week. I believe it's next Wednesday is when Wednesday or Thursday. Wednesday or Thursday. Yeah, yeah. Okay, and uh, yeah, we're gonna we're excited. Um, you know, obviously he has a huge following. We've we've been following his stuff for quite a while, and uh, I've I've loved all the content he's been putting out there. You guys know I'm a big Ferk fan. You know what I mean? So I feel like I am in good company with Mr. Shepard coming over here, the guitar hunter himself. I am so excited to just chat about guitars, show him some of the other guitars we have here. We might have something he's never seen before, and I, I, would, I, would, love to, I would love to show it to him and, and get his thoughts on it, you know? Um, but yeah, that's gonna be next week. So we've, we've got a lot, we've got a lot on the calendar here, guys. Uh, I'm not sure how we're gonna keep up with it, but uh, we're just gonna do our best, and we're gonna do our best to keep you guys informed as we go. So. I think that covers just about everything. Uh, again, go to the Instagram, link is in the description right now. All you need to do is just click over to it. Make sure that you're following us on Instagram. Comment below, tag a friend, that is it. And then we will randomly pick someone. It'll be me again, I always win all of the competitions. Uh, no, I'm joking, no, that's a joke. Um, but uh, no, for real, that's, that's all you have to do is just tag a friend in the comments, make sure that you're following us on Instagram, and then you're entered, and then you might win, and that would be really sweet. And then you just get to pick whatever blue chip you want, and it's yours. I'll send it to you myself, I'll, I'll drive it out to you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hand deliver it to you guys. 
Um, no, but I'll write you a little card or something for it. Um, now, guys, I want to talk about this one. We talked about this. Oh, gosh. When did these come in? Was this Monday? I think it was last week. Was it, was it late last week? Was late it Thursday? Week. Thursday? I think so. Thursday nah, Friday. these came in. We unboxed these yesterday. We unboxed them. but I Oh, they, they came in Thursday. But yeah. we, unbo we unboxed these yesterday. And um, I didn't really get the chance to play them uh, to... Uh, you know, a, a good degree to get like a lot of impressions on them. But this one I have been playing quite a bit now. This is the new Bourgeois. This is the Double O Vintage Heirloom series. This is beautiful, beautiful Sitka, very bear clawed top here. And uh, we have a beautiful rosewood back in sides, East Indian rosewood. And it's gorgeous. These, they, they just pick some fantastic woods for these guitars. Uh, Honestly, I I don't. Uh, there hasn't really been a lot of bourgeois guitars that hasn't completely impressed us. To be honest with you, I mean these are, they're great. I mean every single one that we get in, it's consistently great. And this one, definitely, fantastic. Now I have been playing this one a little bit. Um, it doesn't feel that small. To be honest with you, like I'm used to an OM shape kind of become more of an OM fan here lately. This is a double O, it's a little bit smaller, but it has that square shoulder still, you know? Cause I, I, I've been used to the uh, Eastman double O's with the slope shoulders that have come in here lately, which are great. But uh, man, this one just in a, in a tier in its own, you know, it's uh, hard, hard to say enough about it, but I want to play it for you because I'm just excited to play it, so. It's just such a lovely sound. Gosh, that is just lovely. This guitar is very comfortable, has a beautiful, very warm sound. I will say, if we if we changed the strings, it probably would be just a little bit crispier. But really, I really like where it's at right now. It's got a very warm sound, especially if you pick kind of closer to the to the fretboard, a little above the sound hole there. Don't listen to that last note. Not this note. Everyone just omit that from your memory that I tried to play that note. That note sounds better with it. I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Does this note work in that chord? What chord is that? Everyone tell me in the comments. Everyone tell me what chord that is, because I don't know what it is. Um, and I'll be honest with you, I don't play it very often, so. So let me know what you think of that chord. Let me know what you think of this guitar too. I'm not done playing. No, I'm joking. <laughs> no, I am. <laughs> just kidding. Get an Eastman E6 SS made in an LG2 body. Um. We can certainly ask Eastman. I can. I can. We can ask. I'm gonna. I'm gonna tell you. Probably not. If I'm. If I'm being 100 percent here, probably not. As far as like custom orders go, I feel like Eastman used to fulfill quite a few odd requests for people. Um, these days, I don't think they will. Even if that is just a slight difference in the body shape, I don't think that they'll do it because a lot of times they have those molds put together and they hand make everything. You know, sometimes they can vary something slightly and if there's enough demand for it, they might make new jigs, new molds for things and uh, they might do it. Uh, that happened with the E40 double O. We, we had a lot of requests for that. They said, never, we will never do that. We got answers of like, 
no, probably not. It's not, not going to happen. And then all of a sudden, it happened. I don't know what changed, but uh, some, I don't know. I'll be honest with you, probably not. But if there's enough demand for it, they might. You never know. I mean, we could certainly ask. We could get John to look into it for you. That's just my guess. Um, but hey, I don't know. Maybe they, might, maybe they might. Who knows? But I do want to say again, guys, make sure that you're following. Make sure that you're subscribed because we have a lot of stuff that we're doing towards the end of the year and into the beginning of the year that it's going to be hard to catch up with unless you're subscribed and following us and paying attention to it as it happens. We've got a lot of bourgeois content to come out here soon. We've got some awesome stuff coming from bourgeois and Eastman. Um, and gosh, I mean, we just, it just seems like every week we have new stuff to talk about, crazy stuff we've never seen before, and it just keeps going. So make sure you're following, make sure you're subscribed. If you don't mind, like the video too, you know, hey, uh, if I'm just gonna give you, ask for one more thing there, might as well just ask for an extra like there, you know, if you don't mind. Uh, but you don't have to. It's okay if you don't. I'm not gonna hold it against you. Nice. Yeah, say something really nice to us. We need it. We need some nice comments here, guys. I'm not gonna lie to you. The comments here lately have been wild, and the internet is not a kind place. So uh, we we have we have probably enough content for um, I don't know another 20 mean comment videos. I'd say here lately. So it's been a minute. So. Look out for that here too. I'm sure we'll probably film some more of those because gosh, we got a lot. We have a lot of comments that you guys are giving us. And uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, I'll tell you again. So this is the Eastman, or hold on just a second. This is not an Eastman, sorry. Whoa, 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 whoa. I was just talking about Eastman. Uh, no, this is the Bourgeois Double O Vintage Heirloom Series. This is a beautiful uh, Sitka spruce top with a lot of bear claw in it. And we got this beautiful figuring on this East Indian rosewood on the back and sides. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Love that stripe down the middle there too. It's beautiful. I almost called it an Eastman. It is not an Eastman. This is a bourgeois. And it's beautiful. It's awesome. I want to play it just one more time before we go here, guys. <laughs> It's just a really comfortable guitar, honestly. I think maybe I'm changing my mind again. Maybe I like the double O's and not the OM's anymore. I don't know, guys. I don't know what I like anymore. It just changes every week. But guys, I really appreciate you joining us. We've got a lot of stuff coming out, so make sure that you're following us and paying attention to all of it as it happens. And uh, we'll try and keep you updated with everything as we go, but uh, just really appreciate you stopping by and hanging out with us. So. See ya. Have a good one, and we'll see ya. I guess there's no shop talk tomorrow, right? So there will be. Oh, there will be. Okay. There will be. Jeremy cool. Probably won't be there. Oh, okay. Well, guys, shop talk tomorrow will be an interesting one. Jeremy won't be here, but uh, you know, we'll figure it out. Maybe I'll play mandolin. We always do. I'll play mandolin. Sure. Left-handed. Left-handed mandolin. Sure, guys. I'll play. I know all the songs that the Chapmans know. I'm a great bluegrass mandolinist. Uh, uh, the left-handed variety. So. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Maybe not. They might kick me off. But anyways, I'll see you guys then. Have a great day. We'll see you later.